Hi everybody. Today for science, we're going to hear a, one chapter of this book, Materials in Motion. And this is called The Story of a Chair. Here is a kind of chair you might sit on in a park. Do you know how it was made? A chair begins as a tree in the forest. Here's the tree. A lumberjack cuts the trees in the forest. There he is cutting the tree. A truck driver takes the trees to the sawmill. The trees are cut into boards at the sawmill. And there they are. The boards go to the lumber yard. The woodworker buys wood at the lumber yard. The woodworker makes the chair from wood and then it's put in the park for you to sit on. There it is and that's the end of that chapter. What I'd like you to do today is to walk around and find some things that are made from wood and really take a good look at it. See, study it. See how you think it was made. Once they got, once the woodworker got the lumber from the lumber yard, how did the woodworker make your, whatever you're looking at, Let's see, let me give you an example. Here's the chair that's right next to my table. And I'm looking at it, I'll take the cushion off so I can really see it. I see, I see lines that show that this is one board and this is another board. And this is all from different, it looks like different boards put together. I see a line down the middle there it looks like this isn't the same piece of wood. These are all different pieces of wood. Do you see how the patterns are different from each little board? These are little boards of wood. And look at this. This is where it connects the, this, the back of the chair, connects with the other. I wonder what that looks like underneath. Hmm. The spokes here must be glued in because they don't come out the other side. Look at what I see on the bottom. Look, they stained the wood a different color. I don't know if you can see it. Do you see how it's darker? They stained the wood a different color. This is more the natural wood. And look, I noticed that some of the stain, see, they got some of the stain. They were a little messy with it. They weren't so precise. But this wood is lighter and, oh, so here it comes through, this big part of the chair comes through and I can even see some of the glue. Do you see that right there? That's some of the glue that holds it together and then there's a, a screw of some sort that's holding it there too. So that's interesting, that's interesting. And then there are other, the, the, the part where the legs of the chair come together, there's also a little bit of glue there but it also must, it fits right into this piece here. It's interesting. I never looked at the bottom of that chair before, that stool, it's really a high chair. It's a, um, so I took a look. I learned a little bit that I didn't know. All sorts of things, look at this. I see on the underside, see all these screws? You can't see them. They're right on the underside of the chair. Look, another screw to hold it more screws. Interesting. I never see them because when the chair is standing up the right way, you don't see these things. So take a peek at some of the things that are made from wood in your house and see if you can notice something that you didn't notice before about how it was put together. I also, it must be so interesting the way they 
the way they make this. This was a piece of wood and they shape it probably with that saw that we saw in the book, some sort of saw. Let's take a look back in the book. She's using a handheld saw to shape that chair. Take a look at this big saw with those that big blade. That's cutting the big pieces of wood, but I think probably to make my chair, say this kind of tool here, you probably need a smaller tool. It looks like she's making, this is probably where all the spokes of the chair are going to go in right around. So she's doing that. I noticed that they're done on this side, but on the other side, I don't think they're done yet. Maybe they get done later. Interesting stuff. Be a scientist, make an investigation. What do you see? If you, if you find something interesting, make a drawing in your book and maybe make some notes. Say, what did you, what did you see? What can you share that you saw about something made from wood in your house? Have a wonderful day.